Alrighty guys, welcome back to the Commission Guys YouTube channel and today we're looking at the 2022 Toyota Camry. So let's get building and let's see what we got. Let's go. Alrighty guys, we're looking at the Toyota Camry LE to begin with, so let's look at the engine options. We've got 2.5 liter a dynamic force engine with four wheel, uh, front wheel drive, or we have the all wheel drive option that we can upgrade to. So we'll check out the price, if there's a price uh, change, and there it is, about $2,000 uh, change worth, but it looks pretty good. And having all wheel drive in the rainy conditions and etc. can always be rather helpful so we have our color options we have the pre-dawn gray metallic looks pretty good we have uh, the celestial silver we have white and of course we have the midnight black and we have two different color options black fabric and ash fabric probably go with the black myself but it looks pretty good so we'll leave it as it is no packages to speak of we have the all weather floor mat option that we can uh, upgrade to uh, we can put uh, the dual USB front and rear USB chargers on uh, LED illumination package uh, LED interior package uh, so yes please and yes uh, excuse me yes please uh, definitely very helpful on those we have the phone and cable charge package with two USB ports uh, front and rear USB ports we'll go ahead and upgrade to that there a uh, rear, rear lip spoiler might as well go and have that on there and the trunk LED light bulb yes for 25 bucks I would definitely take that pre-installed if you don't mind and so at the end of the day that's twenty nine thousand two hundred four dollars so not too bad for an all-wheel drive sedan that is very comfortable to sit in even if it is fabric it's still a very comfortable car to sit in so check it out then we jump on up to the SE and let's see what we got here going on with this car so engine options are remain the same you can uh, stay with the front wheel drive on this one we'll see how that works uh, we have some ice edge we have blueprint we have the pre dawn gray metallic we have celestial silver we have white we have the black and we have the supersonic red we also have <clears throat> black soft X uh, interior and we have the ash soft X interior so I believe that's like a mesh is what's going on there we have blind spot monitor with options so let's check out here convenience includes smart key system home link universal transceiver and auto dimming rear view mirror so don't necessarily need those particular things we have uh, the other option here power tilt slide moonroof with options I'm gonna guess that that has something to do with the steering wheel and we have the audio upgrade package uh, which includes uh, blind spot monitor with rear cross traffic alert etc etc with the power tilt and slide moonroof interesting okay so I'm not totally sure what all that means but uh, sounds interesting so I think we'll go ahead and uh, upgrade to the power tilt because I'm pretty sure that's has to do with the steering wheel now we can switch over to the black emblem overlays which looks good but what is the XP package 18 black gloss uh, KMZ mass alloy wheels maze alloy wheels there we go uh, replaces four factory wheels listed caliper covers uh, black lower rocker panel graphite graphic uh, black mirror covers black emblem overlays black rear slip spoiler front grill and surrounds in gloss black and XP badging ooh it makes me happy it makes it look like a, a TRD wannabe so uh, for a lower priced vehicle instead of having to get a TRD that's uh, kinda nice so we have our LED uh, interior we have LED front exterior accent lights ooh see if we can add that looks like we can uh, enhanced illumination package with accent lamps uh, chunk LED package dual USB front and rear USB package there we go uh, paint protection da 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 okay and so thirty three thousand four hundred ten dollars there so once again for full-sized 
sedan with four doors and a very comfortable car that's not too bad now we do have the se nightshade edition uh, we also have uh, SE Hybrid, SE Hybrid uh, Nightshade as well, and then we go to the XLE. Let me check here, just want to kind of want to see what more of the color options on this is than anything else. Uh, engine stays the same, you have the Midnight Black, but see you got the different trim options and different wheel colors that really make it stand out and makes it look really, really good. So that's that's really where where the option is, and it looks it looks really mean so nice let's go ahead and jump up to the XLE see what we got going on with that uh, engine options remain the same we go to the colors we have leather for the first time in the video we have uh, the ruby flare pearl we have the wind chill pearl we have uh, celestial silver metallic uh, the gray mic uh, pre dawn gray mica this color is available for panoramic glass for the front of that. okay let's see ooh hello there Looks nice. Uh, we'll go ahead and go back to the black so we can have the. Okay. So, a bunch of different options kind of cancel out each other. So, we have black perforated uh, leather and we have the ash. Okay, so we go with the black there with the red. And there we go. Going on to the next thing, we have the panoramic glass roof with there we go. Uh, navigation upgrade package. Uh, what does that include? Uh, includes premium audio and navigation and JBL. Very descriptive. Uh, navigation upgrade package and options. Uh, driver assist package includes 10 inch color head up display, bird's eye view camera, perimeter scan, intelligent clearance sonar with rear cross traffic, braking. Braking? Okay, if someone's crossing me from behind. There's, I have no. There's no need for me to be breaking. I'm not sure what that's talking about. Multi-stage ventilated front seats. Hello there. Navigational upgrade package. Okay, so I'm gonna assume that this is just the rear cross traffic thing that just lets you know that someone is crossing behind you. I'm gonna hope that that's all that is, because there should be if cars is crossing traffic behind you. There should be no need for you to be braking. That, that that doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, so, anyways, that's interesting to read there. Anyways, uh, we got a uh, wrist spoiler that we can add on to this car if we wanted to. And uh, basically the same features, but that puts you at 33373 bucks for a sedan with leather seats. Uh, navigation of, uh, let's see here, with uh, vented seats, which is super nice there, etc. With... Uh, leather seats that is, that is very nice so that's XLE right there then we go to the XSE not the XLE but the XSE is next you can get your, get your mouth get your mouth uh, kind of twisted up by all of these trim numbers here and this is where we get fun colors we can get the I don't care give me the colors we get the black metallic roof, we get the metallic roof, we get the metallic roof and we what is this? Uh, we get whatever that is. Uh, let's see. Ice Edge. Ooh, okay. With red cockpit red perforated leather. <laughs> uh, no, sorry. Uh, I gotta go with black. Something about color, uh, color, interiors, and stains just really irk me. It does not make me happy. So let's see. This comes with, what is this? Come black perforated leather. So that looks really, really good. Look at that. That's cool. Yep. That's a good looking car right there. So that's uh, just with that. It's not even packages. And rather confusing packages again. But let's see what we get in this navigation upgrade package. Includes premium audio navigation with JBL. Uh, Two tone exterior, etc. Let's see anything else here. Uh, multi stage ventilated front seats again. Uh, let's go up to the next level here. Driver assist package includes 10 inch, da da da, da da da, multi stage ventilated panoramic, uh, da da da. So, power tilt slide moonroof, premium audio panoramic glass roof with front power tilt slide moonroof. We'll add that on there and see. Can we add that? Oh, nope, we had a... Colors are limited on the... Oh, there we go. So, uh, we have to go up to this one to be able to get that. So, anyways, ventilated seats. In Florida, 
that's a must have accessories we have the black emblem overlays uh, I don't see the other option that uh, I saw before so we'll go with that to really give it that TRD uh, wannabe look we have the front accent lamps and LED front exterior accent lamps and lights and lamps and um, yeah I'm not sure what these are but we're just gonna pick one and I don't care. Why are you changing my options? Okay, so we won't get that. Uh, Undercar puddle illumination. Uh, that in Florida, that's also helpful, especially at night. So there we go. Thirty-eight thousand and sixty-two dollars. Uh, not bad for uh, that that spec of car. And then we head to the beautiful uh, TRD. Let's see what we've got in the TRD. Happy family. We go up to the 3.5 liter V6 24 valve double overhead cam engine with front wheel drive. It looks good already. Beautiful. Alrighty, so we have uh, three color options. We have the midnight black metallic. Okay, let me see the color. We have the wind chill pearl with two tone midnight black metallic roof. Wow, that's a lot. And then we have this beautiful Calvary blue with two-tone midnight black metallic roof it looks really really good there I like it alrighty so that that is just man that is just a beautiful color on that car I love it okay uh, moving on here we'll see what we got we have all season tires we have the TRD premium audio J-O-B with options and that gives us absolutely nothing to look at. Uh, all season tires, TRD premium audio, two-tone exterior. Uh, let's see, does this give us any real info? Nope, not really. Okay, so I'm fine with that, honestly. So I don't really need anything, any of this other stuff. So I'm fine with where we're at on that. Uh, let's see, front and rear, USB ports, we'll upgrade to that. No, we won't. Once again, no, we won't. Wow, they really, they really want you to pay stuff, apparently. Well, I guess, uh, as it is, <laughs> it's fine. So, there we go. $33,935. Not, not any added stuff on there. Let me see here. I think uh, this comes with uh, black with red fabric. Let me see the interior here. Ooh, yeah, that looks good. Looks very nice in there. Nice. Okay, so that's, that is a nice looking car there. So, very, very nice. Alrighty, so we have the XL EV6. Uh, basic options will probably be about the same. But what I'm interested in is the XXE with the V6. And let's see what this has to offer here. So, engine, obviously V6 right there. But we have plenty of color palettes to look at. So, we have uh, the red once again. We have uh, the same base colors, etc. We have uh, the different options through there. And then, of course, uh, got the black roof there, which makes it look absolutely beautiful. And there it is, beautiful car V6 XL XSE. And let's see what kind of options we have. We have the driver assist package, uh, wheel cross traffic braking, all of that normal stuff there. Navigation upgrade, navigation upgrade, navigation upgrade. So cold weather package. Do not need that in Florida. Absolutely do not need that. Uh, let's see what this has. Driver suspension includes the bird's eye view. Uh, navigation upgrade includes premium audio with navigation and JBL. Two tone. Da -da -da. Uh, this includes a uh, driver package, etc. And this includes driver package, multi stage ventilated front seats without JBL. Okay, so there we go. I guess that's. So I'm fine with that, honestly. So anyways, there we go. Uh, all weather floor mats with uh, truck mat. Yes, please. The black emblems. Yes, please. Um, uh, door sill protector with front door illumination. Yes, please. Uh, let's see here. Can we get any of these? Nope. Can't have it that color. Nope. Can't have it unless we have that color. And nope. Can't have it unless we have that color. Okay. LED interior light upgrade. Hey, we can get that. Can we get this? 
Yes, we can get that. Okay, very nice. So, uh, we have a very illuminated card, by the way. Uh, phone cable and charger package with two USB ports. Uh, phone cable, so we'll add that on there. Thank you. And that is it. And this thing rounds out at $40,234. $40, Not bad. Very, very nice looking car. It looks very, very good. It's amazing how well these cars look. It's, just, it's a beautiful car. So, anyways, guys, that is the 2022 Camry. And what model would I go with? Honestly, let's scroll all the way back here. We have the LE SE. I mean, if you needed to, you'd probably go with the XLE or the XSE. But honestly, once you're already at these particular numbers here, you might as well just go with the upgrade and get that TRD it is fabric so I mean it's not the most comfortable seats but hey I mean you could probably uh, as I said uh, I, I think that this is probably a good idea is just hey find uh, one of these cars that has the leather seats or maybe find someone that has leather seats and be able to upgrade the interior make it a very nice comfortable car or uh, even if uh, you might switch out to like uh, race bucket seats or something but this car looks good and it, it's definitely a very good model and just beautiful color right here just that looks awesome so anyways guys that is the Toyota Camry TRD that would be my choice of what car to go with because it just has a lot of the options has a beautiful looking sport package it is it's a beautiful looking car and definitely would be my choice if I'm gonna get one of these but that looks awesome so anyways guys uh, thanks for watching let me know what Camry you would get and we'll see you guys here next time on the combustion guys YouTube channel bye bye